Now comes the fun part of removing the kernels from the cob. So what we're gonna do is you can use a knife, but I have a corn cutter here, and that just makes things really, really easy to remove the kernels from the cob. So after it's already cooled, you're gonna go ahead and take your corn cutter and just kind of go down in a forward motion and remove the kernels from the cob. As you're doing this, you'll know it's really fresh when you start to see some of the milk exuding from some of the kernels. One of the things you can look for when you're selecting your different uh, corn at the market is look for um, different varieties. There's a lot of different varieties of corn that are out there. So there's a standard type of corn that would be like your Silver Queen standard. It's been available for a long time, but you may wanna take a closer look at the different producers to see all the different sweetness and the sugar content that are in the newer varieties. So there's really a sugar enhanced variety and there's also different varieties that are super sweets. So the one that we're using today for our fresh corn salad recipe is ambrosia. Go ahead and add the kernels into a large mixing bowl and look how great that looks with all the different bicolor corn from the ambrosia that we got from Josh at Van Buren's Market. Now to our mixing bowl here, we're gonna take about a half cup of some red onion. We'll go ahead and add that to our mixing bowl. And that looks so colorful against that yellow and white bicolor sweet corn that we have and onions really do add a ton of flavor to our fresh corn salad. Next, we're gonna take about three tablespoons of apple cider vinegar. Just pour that directly on top of our onion that we added. And then we're also gonna add another wet ingredient. This is three tablespoons of just olive oil. So just add that right on top there. Now, we're gonna head and add a little bit of seasoning. We've already gone ahead and measured out half a teaspoon of salt and a half a teaspoon of pepper. So we're just gonna put that right on top. Okay, this is really looking pretty already. So we're just gonna toss all these ingredients, all these fresh ingredients together. Um, this salad recipe is perfect for the summertime. Uh, it's great to go ahead and cut and mix all this together ahead of time. So that way you can just put it in the refrigerator and when you're ready to pull it out, it's already ready to go. So that looks so, so pretty. My mouth is watering. Now, what we're gonna do is just go ahead and set this in the refrigerator for a couple of hours just to chill and marry all these flavors together from the olive oil, the sweet corn, and the onions, and a little bit of the salt and pepper. Here's the secret ingredient that's gonna take it a kick up in flavor. We have gone ahead and harvested some fresh basil, and basil is one of my favorites, and it's gonna look really and taste really good against our other ingredients that we have for our fresh corn salad. So the recipe calls for about a half a cup of fresh basil, and you wanna go ahead and wash the leaves ahead of time, remove any dirt that might be there. Also, it's best to harvest in the morning if you're using fresh basil. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my herbs scissors that I have here and you can take a couple if you want to and what I do is roll it up so that way I can go ahead and take my herb scissors and I'm gonna add my fresh basil. If you don't have herb scissors you can go ahead and use like a knife and go ahead and cut that on a cutting board but one nice thing about these herb scissors is that you've got a comb and basically you're just gonna run it through there on both sides and it's already kind of chiffonade. It's already gonna be in tiny strips for you. So man, that smells so good. You will want to incorporate the basil in the last couple of minutes right before you get ready to serve and it will look so festive in our fresh corn salad. And again, it is so beautiful with all the different colors from the onion and the sweet corn and the basil your guests are absolutely gonna love it. We served our fresh corn salad along with some blue corn tortilla chips and also some other tortilla chips that are great for scooping right into your mouth. This will be a great recipe. It's simple. It's got that summertime taste of the sweet corn. Uh, and so you definitely wanna make sure that you get this recipe. So if you'd like more information about today's episode, see our show notes. We've got the recipe there and we've also got more information about Van Buren's market. And if you would like more information about other sweet corn growers in your area, contact us again. You know, mm -hmm. it is a lot of work, but it, that you do reap a lot of rewards. Don't rat me. I got more questions.